Okay, and uh, back to the Mount Haito. Um, I went down and I upgraded my stuff. Um, of course, uh, I did gain a couple of skill points on the way back up. Um, I also saved down in Brass Castle. Um, because if you were not at, at least level 5 with all of your characters, I would not take this on. Um, if this is your first time through on this, uh, I probably uh, wait till I, I'd be at a level 10. Uh, probably upgrade my skills a little more, but. Skills. Um, I did get um, him just up to rank D with this. Um, I'd probably um, go for. Maybe, uh, <coughs> excuse me, um, rank C with, uh, with both these things if I, uh, really was doing this on my own and had the chance to actually stick around to uh, level up on. That is one of the things that I think I'm going to do, uh, after this recording session. Um, I think, uh, basically what I will do is, uh, I will uh, just get the kid here, so then I will uh, save and quit. So, as with a uh, seal, um, I upgraded basically just her damage one. Uh, <laughs> again, I would like to have her damage at least to a rank C. Um, and her accuracy up to a rank D, at least, uh, for, uh, for what's coming up, so. Um, even though we are going into Mount Haito, uh, right now, I would not take on the, uh, Blue Mantis with these guys as they are at, so. Or so you're just gonna get completely slaughtered. Um, we're gonna have a hard enough time, uh, Versus the actual uh, kind of boss, so <coughs> um, I upgraded his accuracy uh, just a little bit. Um, I also decided to put him in the front row here, so because uh, hopefully Piccolo will uh, last long enough to actually get it to go through. Um, I put his uh, lightning magic up to rank C, so hopefully uh, that will be enough to take out the boss. Um, at most, I'm uh, I'm thinking I will get one off with him before he kills me, um, if that. So save your uh, magic care if you can. So. Yeah. Luckily, um, the enemies here, they aren't quite as uh, tough as that uh, in Ghetto's chapter, so... Easier, a bunch of help. As I said, uh, we're not gonna really be sticking around here that long. Uh, I would get out of here as uh, as soon as possible. So. Okay. Uh, we have new enemies here: the furry fly or fur fly. Um. Um. If they were closer together, um, I'd probably just use Warhorse to uh, take them all out, but, uh, right now, um, the main thing that I want to do is, uh, take out the Creeper there, because, uh, 
that is going to be the worst enemy that I have uh, in this group, so... And save your magic, as I said. Uh, one walk up, so he is attacking really isn't that bad for uh, for as low a level as he is, so I probably should have uh, shown this off too. Um, I did uh, upgrade, um the old sword here, um, I think I upgraded that as a steel spear too. Yep. And I did, uh, upgrade, uh, Piccolo stuff, um, he was at level 1 with his attack, so. Not that he's going to be uh, that effective as an attacker as, uh, as he is anyway, so... If anything, um, I probably should have uh, kept stuff around it, uh, actually uh, upgraded like his armor or whatever, but... Not going to be uh, using him, at least not too much, so. Hopefully I won't uh, have to use him like uh, really at all, but I know I'm going to have to, so. Because he really sucks as a fighter. Shoot. It's hoping that I, I can pick something up off the ground here. Uh, like that, there'd be a, like a medicine bee or whatever, but. You know, oh well, so. As with uh, the corpses uh, up north of us, uh, just leave those things for now because uh, uh, we really don't have any. Uh, need to go up there right now and uh it's definitely not going to be the best thing so but I'll uh, just need this or that stuff for now I kind of thought that uh, I'd get into a few more random battles on the way in so Four for flies, and uh, I got a question mark uh, figurine, so. I think it was a figurine, yeah. I was gonna say, I don't think it's a painting, so. The thing that uh, really sucks with that, the guys having as low hit points as they do is that uh, you have to heal basically at the end of every single battle, so. And, um, there should not be a boss up here, up to, up to the north, but I know th three fur flies, and fortunately, uh, Juan took a little bit of damage there, so. Alright, guess I could probably leave him. Um, 
I was thinking that he had like 29 hit points left, but... As I was saying, um, I know, um, there's a boss to the right of me, um, that is where I'm going to want to head, but, uh, when I go up this way first, so... I think this is a dead end. I'm seeing a good train, so... Hmm. Hmm. I thought Thomas could uh, check dead bodies, but apparently he can, so. Oh well, so. Two fur flies. Um, we'll just uh, come back up here and uh, get that uh, later on in somebody else's chapter, so. I don't think that uh, I'm t missing a. Uh, Two fur flies. Um, I don't think I'm missing terribly out on anything uh, right now, so. But before I move on, um, I want to have everybody at a uh, full strength for what's coming up, so. I was thinking that we get to the kitchen right away, but... Two fur flies, and they dropped another uh, custom work figurine for me, so... Um, I'm not gonna bother healing up a um, wand yet, so... Didn't uh, take too much damage, so... But they only got hit for two, so... Three fur flies, and uh, it did a little more damage to uh, Thomas than I'm comfortable with, so. I should be able to do a little upgrading of uh, the weapons after this, so. But, I guess it'll depend on. Uh, how much the uh, boss is actually worth? Yeah, you gotta remember that normally this thing would not be a boss, it'd just be a regular enemy, but we're just so freaking weak. Not a good idea. <sighs> okay. I think this thing... Right now, it can uh, take us out with like uh, one or two attacks each, so. Just uh, go with uh, basically your strongest stuff. Let's see. Eh. You know what? Eh. Gotta go with lightning. Um, I'll go with uh, Berserk Blow because um, I'm 
pretty sure that uh, that has a little less casting time than Song Ball, so... Well, at least he uh, got one, so... I did a much better job than I thought it would. I was kind of afraid that uh, I'd be at such a low level that I'd have to cast two of them, but... Well, uh, nothing much else to do here except, uh, get out of here, I guess, so. <coughs> See how many, uh, random battles I run into here, so. I think I'm gonna... A creeper and uh, three four flies. Um, plus, I got two question mark figurines from it. So, hmm, gonna leave one for a while. So, I was thinking about uh, upgrading him already, but sorry, using medicine, but. Two creepers, and unfortunately, they did a uh, real number on one, so I was kind of hoping that I could uh, just leave them alone, but you know, I kind of want the experience for them, so not that uh, he's gonna be the best fighter that I would doubt, far from it, but. Well, he's uh, he's better than uh, Thomas and uh, definitely Piccolo right now. Um, I'd say uh, Seal is probably a little more useful, but that's uh, probably just because uh, Juan is asleep all the time, so... But... Uh. And, of course, a uh, little random battles after I got into that one, so, but, oh well, so. Okay, um, in the next episode, I will, uh, be going back over to the lake castle here with the kid, but, um, I think uh, for right now, I'm going to sign off on um, this video 15. You've been watching Let's Play Sweet In, and uh, when I come back, um, I'll probably have uh, gained a few levels and uh, sharpened my weapons a little bit, so um, 
but uh, I will uh, see you later.